typically for long lasting relief of pain right um we do two commonly done procedures mm-hmm. uh, one is a radio frequency ablation what do you mean by a procedure is it a surgery is it like no, opening no it is not a surgery mm-hmm. it's a needle that is passed in to or in the vicinity of the of okay. any any particular structure okay usually done under guidance okay with or without sedation sometimes needing a general anesthesia but means, there is no cut oh, there is no cut we are oh. not removing any portion of Got the body we are no not stitch. making absolutely no stitch, no stitch. so this is what we call as a procedure got it now this procedure can be a little painful uh, you may tolerate it depending upon what your threshold for pain is but you do use local anesthesia we do use local yes, anesthesia yes. when i'm saying you may tolerate it there are a lot of uh, patients even with local they oh, will jump uh, so it, the sensitivity i agree i agree yeah. will will be individual individually so we use these two procedures very commonly one is a radio frequency ablation the other is a percutaneous balloon compression got it what is radio frequency ablation as uh, i mean can you give it in layman's terms so that our audience or so, not doctors uh, understand so a lot of to a lot of my patients i say laser surgery mm-hmm. i'm using the wrong word yeah. but that's a very easy way to make them understand <laughs>